Ukraine needs all the military support we can give so that they can defend their country and they can defend their freedom. Thank you. And uh, in terms of sanctions, um, what needs to be done next with sanctions? And uh, what is your understanding of how well the sanctions are working on Russia when we're seeing uh, Russia's official statistics that are showing that, for example, its economic decline is not as big as earlier predicted? The sanctions are working, otherwise Putin wouldn't bring this up all the time or the Russian propagandists uh, saying that, you know, lift the sanctions or, you know, nothing to see here, everything is fine. Um, they are working. Uh, what we have to work on the European side is, of course, um, to deal with the circumvention of sanctions. Not only the sanctions that we put in place, but that they actually work and there are no loopholes. And that is something that we have to move on with. Uh, making, you know, circumvention of sanctions also criminalized. And what is your prediction on when and perhaps how the war will end? The war will end when Russia realizes it was a mistake. And uh, when is that? It is uh, uh, very much related to uh, the army uh, doing the way uh, they are. So if we provide Ukraine the military help, um, so uh, the signal to the army could be also that you can't really win this. I mean, we have seen Russia realizing before that you know war in Afghanistan was a mistake. So they went back to uh, their country. So this is uh, something what that we need to see that Russia goes back to their borders um, and, and uh, then the war will end.